Oh, he got me. That was the line I thought I'd get you on. Alright folks, how's it going? Hope it's not too windy, I've got the muffler on it right now. Uh, we're going for a day today over at the local where there has been a new track dug. Now we did ride it with Dave Jemby, uh, hopefully you'll have seen that vlog by now. But you know, I didn't want to leave Dave on his own struggling down there, it's quite a tough track. So I rode it pretty steady. Um, so I'm going to ride it in anger today. Uh, Todd and I, we're both going to film it. I've got a mate Coiny coming over, meeting some of Todd's mates as well, so it should be a good crew. Now also, if you've been keeping an eye on the media and the videos, you'll see that we've fitted all the uh, WTB tyres now. So I just want to show you what we are rocking today. Here's my big boy, the 29er, Switch 9er, and on the rear, you can see that the sealant I'm using it is ty tire yogurt you just see there's a little bit of red coming through the edges which is quite normal with sealant overnight and then it'll kind of settle so i've got a vigilante 2.6 29er on the back and then on the front the same vigilante 2.6 now both of these the difference with these and the ones i had on before is these are the lights so the high grip lights, so they're a lot lighter tyre, but they're still super grippy and got a lot of sidewall protection in them, a lot more than any sort of snakeskin. And then over to Todd's bike here, we have, he's got a Trail Boss on the back. That says semi-slick, but it's not like most semi-slicks, it's got a lot more bite, but a 2.4 and that is also the light fast rolling that's the the fast rolling is what you have on the back so that's a little bit softer uh, a bit harder rubber and you get the softer rubber is the high grip and then he has the high grip vigilante 2.5 on the front and also obviously it's a hard tail day today as you can uh, I'm sure you can work out we have finally been given the new Fidlock bottles. These new ones are a darker grey and they got the black top and uh, yeah, absolutely spot on. Very excited about getting these. So the bikes are set up. Just got to wait for Coiny now and then um, get their bikes in and then shoot on over to Eastridge. Now another product has just been given. There's two of these and these are super cool. I haven't even put these on any media or anything yet. These are from Australia. And they're called the Fumper Pump, or Fampa Pump, as I'm sure it sounds better in their accent. Now this is the mini one, and I've got the full size one over there, which I'll show you in a minute. You basically charge them on a USB, and they are for uh, the smaller high pressure valves only. You just push them in, and that's it. And that is a trail side electric compressor pump they say it'll do two tires so i'm going to bring that with me today probably won't use it but um it's a really cool little product i don't know anything else about it yet but it looks really well made really solid and um, you know some things can be a bit rough around the edges if they come from certain countries but the aussies know how to make stuff let me show you the other one all right so here's the other one it's been uh, charging away overnight so usb right Whoa. <laughs> coin is here. Hello. Big coin. How you doing? Right. How did it feel uh, meeting your idol last week with Jay Dave Jemby? Oh, brilliant. Yeah? Love his vlogs. You've watched every one, haven't you? Yeah. More than once, some of them. We got the Babs. Hello. We got the little Bab here. Hello. Jack. Hello. And then your brother over there, Billy. New helmets. When did you buy the Liats? Uh, uh, when did we have them, Bill? Madam, uh, bye. How are you, Billy? Bye. You ready to hit some trails with us? Yeah. As usual, Todd's faffing. You alright, son? You ready? Do I need to go first? Yes. 
you're filming today as well. Okay. We want some of your footage down this new trail. We're gonna have double footage, okay? Okay. Let's see how good Todd's got. Yeah, dude. First go, of this is the van pump. pump. I'm gonna call it the van one or workshop. Um, so it's on PSI. You basically flick that button over. And in the back, I want, I'm gonna go for, I'm gonna go for 20 in this tire. It's quite a high volume tire. Let's try it out. Push it on. It's only seven at the moment. I thought it was low. <laughs> 20, that'll do. Sound, that's really good. I'm really impressed with that. Like buddy, summer almost. The trails have dried out loads with this wind. Ah, oh, it's running amazing. Yeah, nice. So on the fire road up, as we come round from the way that we parked. I always see this trail. I do it now and then, but not very often. This is the bottom section. It's only dead short, but it's really steep at the bottom. I went across the fire road. I don't think I've ever done that. So, you gonna film it as well, Todd? Yeah. You boys ready for it? Yeah, I'm ready. Let us do it. Let's do make drinking or menu for the lock, y'all. No dog to unbottle this. These are loads stronger than the last bottle, aren't they? Yeah. They are really hard. Oh, I like that. Mark two. Right then. Are you filming? Yep. You gonna follow us in, coinage? Yeah. I followed you. It's been a while since I've done this one. Wait. Go on in. Oh, God. <laughs> the right moment then. name is not onions I don't know what happened I think it was one of them like forgot I was on a hardtail moment I started attacking it like full sauce and the back end just like bounced around on me Woo! it's super slick Come on. I think I got it. I got scared of you, so I didn't want to run him over. <laughs> Don't know where this goes and what it does. It's a bit up and downy by the looks of it. Them lads are making some noise back there. Whoa, nice. So if you want to see how steep that little bit of a trail is, that's where we just crossed the fire road and gone round there and back up. But that's it there. So it's sort of come from up there. I know it looks bugger all on camera, always does, but yeah, that is pretty steep. All right, so I fell from the top. Yeah. Because Ian ran in front of me, so I went up high, and I don't know what happened. I went like sideways, and I was like, oh no, I can't stop. So it was sliding, and I fell and I just rolled all the way down. This is horrible on our tail, anyway. I fall you the dog. Okay. There we go. Time for a hardtail rattler. Better that it's actually kind of dried out a bit. Be nice if it was like downhill. Now it's starting to go downhill. Whoosh! Whoosh! Definitely a lot slower on this section. Oh. So bumpy. There we go. Off the rocks. Ah, now we can get on a decent track. Oh. So 
So the plan is this one, go down here. Uh, this is the one that followed Dave Jemby last weekend and for some reason uh, uh, that footage failed. I don't know, problem with the card. So now hopefully attack this. It's a shame because he went down here really well and really surprised me. He launched that drop as well. Yeah, he did. So we're gonna go down here and cut across and then get onto the new trail. I got to press play, sorry. Ah, there we go. Yes, get it nice. This is the drop that Dave launched off. He got it so well. I was gutted it didn't show. Oh, I do love riding this hard town. So good. Not that squeaking is in my helmet. I'm gonna have to have a look at that. Way. This is definitely getting rougher. When this was first put in, it was like pure loam. Has Jack surprised you? Yeah, when I could hear him like pedalling up behind me, and I wasn't like going as slow as a. So could. strong, isn't he? Yeah. He's, he's definitely faster than me when I'm on hard Is he? Yeah. Oh dear. Right then. So this is. I think this is called. Could be topography. Could be wrong. Get them all mixed up. Uh, yeah, well, this is good fun. Following Jack, who is, who I've now realised is faster than me when I'm on a hard tail. It's so funny watching him ride because he's so small and his bike's too big for him. He doesn't look real. I can hear a little uh, jack behind me. I need to get my toe down a bit. Right. Out and on the power. Ian, Jack, son. No! Whoa! That nearly had me off. Okay. Hill climb on the road, beginner. Go on, now I'm going to follow Wee Man on this little short bit and see if I can outline you. Go on. Got a new name for you. What? Got a new name for you. What? Little Bull. Okay. You know, I like Bull. Yeah. Can I get him on the line? He's so good on a bike. Oh, he got me. That was the line I thought I'd get you on. That's it, I'm done trying. <laughs> it's uphill now. We need to let you know about Jack. That's Billy. Todd is 13. How old are you? 14, turning 15. 15 in about a couple of weeks, is it? Yeah, 24 days. And how tall are you? I don't know. He's like four foot one. And you're Billy. Come on. You're the youngest, aren't you? Yeah. But you're tallest. Well, not tallest out of me. No. <laughs> And Todd is slightly under height for your age, would you say? Yeah, I'm 5'3". And his power, Jack's power and speed, absolutely oh. unbelievable. I mean, he's pushing you down that one hill, isn't he? Yeah, he rides like a man. And he's like up the hills, he's beating both of us, isn't he? Yeah. He's unreal. Yeah. What, does your, what do your parents feed you? Uh, food. I don't Good. know, really. Like... What was that food you, you told him? What was that food you told him about and he didn't need never heard oh, of it? There's loads of things. I don't know half the, we told him we asked him if they wanted lasagna, Bill was like, what's one of them? <laughs> asked him if they wanted a bagel, they'd never even heard of a bagel. And they thought it was the most amazing food ever. Them boys proper country boys. Yeah. Come on then country boys, let's do this new trail. Yeah. Alright, so it's along this flat to the new bit. Oh, we have this huge 
100 foot double here that we have to do every time you're here oh my god it's really wet oh, it slid as i took off okay so because this is new it's loamy and the loam doesn't last long here it goes down to the bedrock so you've got to make the most of it ian onion Oh. Yeah, I'll snap off some of these branches so it's rideable. Like the hardest branches in the world. Obviously I can't move the whole tree but at least we can do something to make it sort of rideable. I'll just go for here. I'll follow you, Corinne. Oh no problem. Following Robert Lloyd's. <laughs> nice one, Mongo. <laughs> so this is steep but loamy. So it's not very scary if you like. I think you're gonna crash. Hero dirt. Soft. Saves your life. Yeah, it's still totally in the way, that branch of mine. Yeah, coming through. Oh, what a place to stop. Yes, so good. That is ace, isn't it? So well made. Has he bent them around? He's a little beast, isn't he? On, Todd, try and follow him on this little bit. He got some good lines before and he was quick. Try and keep up. He's already losing, yeah? Come on! <laughs> oh my god! He smoked you, man! Thank you, boss. Yeah. Ian, come here. Sit. Sit. Paw. Other paw. Nicely. Right, so we just come across these lads here at the top of the trail. And this is totally genuine. He's stuck here, back tire, he can't seat it. So let's see if the mini thumper can sort out this problem. I doubt it can, because it's not a it's not like a blaster thing, but it's worth a try. Ah, you don't have to keep your finger on it, that's what it was. So when it comes to unseating or seating, it's a no from the thumper. Right, so here we go, another run track is uh free no one in front let's see if we can get down and put a good run in oh here much out that's so steep that bit it's so good <laughs> Yeah, don't think you need that rut. Maybe when it's wet. I really want to see Dave Jambi like riding this, you know, to do it in like maybe next year. Sketchy there. Oh, 
tight there with that tree. Oh, it's perfect condition. Whoa, front end went a bit there. But now it's steep and the eyes are watering. So good. And that's it. What a nice trail. Following Ja. Small 15 year old. Yeah, you're going under the fallen tree. Where? <laughs> Little drop. Still not used to the hard tail. Feel very slow on it. Yeah, Jack crashed and bent his bars. It's useless. Come on, boys. Oh, fist bumpy central. Sending it. Watch out, Ian. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Stay, oi, oi, stay. Come on, then. Hey, how are you? All right. How are you? Yeah, sound you. We are back home now. Uh, awesome ride that was today. I want to know what you think about young Jack. Uh, seriously impressed us. And his younger brother, although he's bigger, he's a 12 year old. You know, the stuff he was riding for 12. And obviously Todd's improvement. Coiny and I are blown away by these kids and how well they ride. Just kids in general nowadays on bikes, it is ace. Um, so give us your comments on that and your comments on this new trail at Eastridge and the loam and anything you want to say really big thanks for watching remember check out our affiliate links where you can buy some of our products that we use at a discounted rate and um, we've got the links to the website with all our merchandise on there and give us a like give us a subscribe if you're not subscribed give us a comment hit that bell thanks a lot for watching keep it pinned